checking in on your forecast for this morning. We've got some really beautiful conditions out there. Definitely looking a little bit different than it did over the last couple days as we've got nice clear conditions. No major areas of fog this morning, but it is a little bit on the windy side right now. 16 miles an hour for those sustained winds at Avila Beach, and we're going to be continuing to see lots more of those gusty conditions all the way through the next few days as those winds are increasing. So are those temperatures, though. So good news there. Checking out those clouds and fog at this point. Beautiful clear conditions out there, no major areas of dense fog. And this is really an indication that our pattern is changing. We're starting to see that high pressure build in, and that's what's going to really bring us some much warmer temperatures by the later portion of the daytime hours today and throughout the rest of this week as well. But before we get to there, we do still have those clear skies and clear skies typically mean slightly cooler conditions for our morning hours. About 37 degrees in California Valley, 43 in San Inez, not too bad at 51 degrees in Santa Barbara right now, 41 in Santa Maria and 39 degrees in Paso Robles right now. Not too bad as we start off the day, but we've got a big pattern change on the way as this cold front continues to push farther towards the east and we've got high pressure headed our way and that's going to stick around for quite a while. This ridge of high pressure is going to really transform the entirety of our forecast for the next couple of days, taking us from just the 50s in many locations yesterday into the 80s by the weekend. So big changes are on the way, but that's also being driven by a larger wind event. So we're continuing to see all of those pesky wind gusts that we've seen over the last few days continuing in the next few days as well. We do have several advisories along our south coast as well. So right now, still a little bit more on the gusty side. By about 9 a.m., we're going to be continuing to see those offshore winds starting to transition to the onshore winds by later on in the daytime hours. We do still have those wind gusts along our south coast upwards of 30 miles an hour. Either way, it's still going to be quite a gusty one out there. And then we're going to be seeing even more of those gusty conditions over the next few days as well. Even stronger winds expected for your Thursday and your Friday mornings. Because of all those winds, we do have lots of wind advisories. Wind advisories along the south coast all the way through 3 a.m. We are are continuing to see this section of this advisory is just through this morning, but still lots of winds expected here on the central coast. Checking out those temperatures, 66 degrees in Paso Robles, 65 in San Luis Obispo, 64 for Santa Maria, 63 in Lompoc, and 75 degrees in Santa Barbara for today. But just look at that warm up, 60s for today, 80s by Friday throughout much of the central coast, staying in the 80s all the way through Sunday in Paso Robles. Slightly cooler elsewhere, but still very comfortable conditions across the central coast all the way through the next few days and we're going to be continuing to see all those warmer conditions even into early next week. Neil and Janelle back to you. Wow, nice